we're going to show you really quickly how to do a character fly-in in PowerPoint. Um, the effect would be something like that, and it's very simple to do. We'll go ahead and get started. Okay, so to fly in a character, basically you're going to have, um, if you have two characters, you're going to have three different assets. You're going to have the background asset, and you're going to have um, your two characters. Um, and then all I've done, and let me go ahead and just you know, strip out this right now. Um, let's delete these animations. Um, I, and I always like to work with the selection of visibility pane open, and then anytime I'm doing animations, I like to have the animation pane open. But um, what we're going to do is uh, do a fly-in. Um, so it's just a, a fly-in. So we'll go fly-in, and um, we actually want it to come from the left. And it'll preview it for me there. And him, I want to do a fly-in as well. And I want to do that from the right. And then um, if I were just do that right now, um, it'll go one then the other. And since I want them to come at the same time, um, I can just click here and go start with previous. Um, now if I preview that, you'll see they both come in at the same time. And you can control the speed um, by going um, into the, uh, the the timing and you can change how fast they, they go. Um, but I think that it actually looked um, pretty good there. And one of the ways I actually like to, to use this is when I'm um, trying to create an establishing shot. So maybe first I want to set the scene and um, that they're in the hallway. So I could have the scene start with the hallway and then I could bring the characters in. Um, so it's a nice way to um, to add some motion and, and, and then introduce the characters after you've introduced the scene. Um, I hope you found that useful. Um, one thing to note, I don't think I did at the beginning, um, is what you need um, is to have characters that have the backgrounds removed and saved as PNGs with transparencies. Um, and um, you can cut out the backgrounds yourself or there are you know, a bunch of services, including um, mine, that'll have the, the images with the backgrounds already removed for you. Um, yeah, hope you found that useful. Stay tuned for more lessons. Thanks, bye.